Morning YouTube Pipe community, Mark here, Northeast Piper UK. And I was smoking Old Faithful this morning and I've decided to change the softy bit. So I got the idea off another YouTube channel. So I thought I would do a little tutorial for those who don't know about it and stick it on my channel. It's really cheap and easy to do. So what you'll need is a cup of boiling water, a spoon, a pair of scissors, and some clear plastic chewing. I got this from my local DIY shop and it cost us two pound fifty for a metre length. So which like I say it isn't it isn't really expensive um, for what it does. So what I did with um this one and I put that on there, I must have smoked it about ten times, then I took it off, gave it a good clean, and then swapped it round, popped it back on and same again so it does discolor a little bit but to be quite honest with you it's it's not really that bad so first of all we'll take the old one off there we go as you can see it's it has discolored a little bit but not too bad really i mean i probably could, could just give this a clean and pop it straight back on but for hygiene purposes i mean again it's it's not expensive so so that's the old one gone so again just get your new tube get a rough idea of how big you want it give it a snip and just pop it in your boiling water I feel like I'm on blue Peter here you don't need to leave it in there for too long it softens up pretty quick just give it a little, little squeeze with the spoon there just to see what it's like and then take it out there I feel it's quite, quite easy and manageable now and then just pop it on there we are all ready to go these ones it's quite easy to get on um, but such as the larger bits In this case on the on the Savinelli what I did was I let it soak in the boiling water for a while so it was really really soft and then just I got it on one end and just using the edge of the spoon I just sort of gently eased it on and then just worked both ends slowly down until it until it fit on there and um, that was it all done So there you are. Um, I don't tend to clench as much now. What I've been tending to do is just sort of putting it to my lips and taking a slow draw. But it's nice that if I'm reading a book or I'm doing something, if I'm playing around making some tampers, then I can you can get a good clench in my back teeth there, and um, it's not making a mess of the of the stem so there you are hope uh, that's given you the insight and given you a chance to go and make your own so hope you're all safe and well and you've been having a great weekend and don't forget to load up light up and enjoy and i'll see you soon bye for now